start by having the lesson one folder open. If you go to the bottom right hand corner there, then get the icons enlarged. And we're just going to start off then with our revision task. So let's double click that. Just load up into Excel. So if you just make sure that we're on the start sheet here and put your name and class in there and then on to task one. So this is a revision, so it's things that you've done plenty of times before. It's the way that you do these now that's important. So one hand on the mouse, one hand on the keyboard. You don't need to type any cell references in. So click in there, start with equals, and we're adding these. So we click, press add on the number pad, click, press enter. Okay, so complete the other addition ones. Let's have a look then at the subtraction. So it's going to be equals and it's the small number taken away from the big number. So there's the big number and we take away the small number. Okay, again, complete those. The multiplication, it's going to be working from left to right because it doesn't say anything else. I'm trying to get to that habit every time work from left to right. Divide the big number by the small number. So that's not always left to right. So it won't be there, for example. But if it doesn't specify, then do it that way. Okay, add all these numbers together in this box. So to add probably more than three numbers together, we use the equals sum function. So equals sum and open bracket. You can either double click on it or put the bracket in yourself. So when you're highlighting, get in the middle of that cell, click and do not let go of the mouse until it's highlighted. Even if it goes wrong and it goes outside, just keep hold of that mouse button, pull it back, close the bracket. Uh, once here then, finding the average, so I'm going to put in equals AV and then double click the word average. Again, click, do not let go until you've finished highlighting. Close the bracket, press enter, complete those last two. Go back up to the top okay, and then check your score is 20 out of 20 and save that file. 